Welcome to our channel. Don't forget to subscribe and put likes, because your support is important for us. And here we go. In a significant gesture of regional cooperation, the Ministry of Defense of Thailand has officially handed over a fleet of 10 Advanced Armored Tactical Vehicles ATVs, to the Royal Bhutan Police. The handover ceremony, held at the ministry's headquarters, was presided over by Defense Minister Sutton Klungsang and attended by notable dignitaries including General Porfil Main Aaron, Chairman of the Defense Technology Institute DTI, and Naparat Kulhiran, Chairman of Chaiseri Metal and Rubber Co. Limited representatives from the Bhutanese Embassy in Bangkok were also present to receive the equipment on behalf of the Himalayan Kingdom's police force. The Chaiseri First Win, the model of ATV donated, is a state-of-the-art defense vehicle designed to meet the rigorous demands of modern security missions. It is powered by a 300-horsepower engine and provides ballistic and mine protection compliant with Stanag 4569 Level 2 standards, with an option to upgrade to Level 3. This ensures the vehicle's resilience against a variety of threats, enhancing the safety of its occupants. The First Win is designed to accommodate 10 people, 9 plus 1, featuring a right-hand drive and a monocoque structure that optimizes safety and maneuverability. The vehicle's run-flat system allows it to continue driving up to 50 kilometers even after a tire puncture, a critical feature in hostile environments. The dimensions of the first win include a length of approximately 6,100 mm, a width and height of 2,400 mm each, and a ground clearance of 450 mm. It weighs about 11,000 kg with a payload capacity of 1,500 kg and a gross weight of approximately 12,500 kg. Its 200-liter fuel tank provides a combat range of 650 km, and it can reach a top speed of 110 km per hour. The vehicle can handle slopes of up to 60%, side slopes of 30%, vertical obstacles of up to 500 mm, and forward water depths of 1,000 mm. For armaments, the first win is equipped with a 12.7mm heavy machine gun, a 40mm automatic grenade launcher, and a 7.62mm medium machine gun, with an option to install a remote controlled weapon station, RCWS. Additional optional features include a central tire inflation system, CTIS, thermal night driving capability, an automatic fire suppression system, VHF tactical communication, an intercommunication system, a mobile assault ramp system, MARS, and a laser warning system, LWS. It also boasts an 18,000-pound self-recovery winch, an ABS braking system, and a situational awareness system with day and infrared cameras, ensuring optimal performance in all conditions. The donation of these advanced ATVs reflects Thailand's commitment to assisting Bhutan in modernizing its police force and enhancing its preparedness for various emergency situations, including natural disasters and internal security operations. These vehicles will enable Bhutanese forces to navigate difficult terrains and better protect their operators in hostile environments. This initiative also underscores the importance of regional security collaboration. Regular exchanges and training programs between Thailand and Bhutan further highlight the significance of this partnership. Such cooperation aligns with Bhutan's economic and social development goals and strengthens regional stability. According to the CIA Factbook 2023, the Royal Bhutan Army has approximately 8,000 active military and security service personnel. India's long-standing support in providing military equipment underscores the strong defense relationship between Bhutan and India, which is vital for Bhutan's military readiness and operational capabilities. Notably, the same Chaiseri First Win ATVs provided by Thailand are being used by a Bhutanese contingent deployed in the Central African Republic for the United Nations mission, MINUSCA. In October 2022, Bhutan deployed its first-ever peacekeeping military contingent, a Light Quick Reaction Force, LQRF, to MINUSCA at the UN's request. This contingent is set to complete its mission by November 2023 and will be replaced by another from the Royal Bhutan Army. The donation of the Chaiseri First Win ATVs by Thailand marks a significant enhancement in Bhutan's security capabilities. It not only strengthens the operational readiness of the Royal Bhutan Police but also solidifies the bonds of regional cooperation and mutual support. As Bhutan continues to develop its defense and security infrastructure, such international partnerships will be crucial in ensuring the safety and stability of the region. That's all for now. See you later.